Hey there, cat lovers, welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an important topic to discuss, how to effectively remove tree sap from your cat's fur, hand paws. We all know how curious our feline friends can be, and sometimes they end up getting into sticky situations. Don't worry though, because I've got you covered. In this video, I'll share some tried and tested methods to safely remove tree sap from your cat's fur, hair, and paws. So let's get started. But before we dive into the techniques, let me quickly remind you to check out the link in the description below. There, you'll find an in-depth article with additional tips and information on this topic. Trust me, it's worth a click. Now, let's talk about the supplies you'll need for this process. Here's a list of items you should gather before you begin. A pair of latex gloves to protect your hands. A wide tooth comb or a brush suitable for your cat's fur type. A towel or cloth. A pet safe grooming spray or oil. Some warm water. Mild peat shampoo or dish soap. Before you start the actual cleaning process, it's essential to prepare the area. Find a quiet and comfortable space where your cat feels relaxed. It's a good idea to have a non-slip mat or towel in place to prevent your furry friend from slipping during the process. Now, let's tackle the actual removal of the tree sap. Here's how you can do it. Put on your latex gloves to protect your hands from any potential irritation. Gently hold your cat and examine the affected areas. Look for clumps of sap or sticky residue. Using your fingers, carefully and slowly separate the fur around the sap without pulling or tugging. Once you've loosened the sap, Take a wide tooth comb or brush and gently work through the fur. Start from the outer edges of the sap and gradually move inward. Be patient and take your time to avoid any discomfort for your cat. After you've removed most of the tree sap, it's time to apply a pet safe grooming spray or oil. This will help break down the remaining residue and make it easier to remove. Here's how you do it. Take a small amount of the grooming spray or oil in your hand and rub it gently between your palms. Carefully apply the product to the affected areas of your cat's fur, hair, and paws. Make sure to distribute it evenly, but avoid getting it in your cat's eyes or mouth. Massage the area gently allow the product to penetrate the sap and loosen it from the fur. Now that the grooming spray or oil has had a chance to work its magic, it's time to cleanse and rinse your cat's fur. Here's what you need to do. Wet a towel or cloth with warm water. Make sure it's not too hot, as it could discomfort your cat. Gently wipe the affected areas with a damp towel, applying light pressure to remove the remaining sap. If needed, you can use a small amount of mild pet shampoo or dish soap. However, make sure to use only pet-safe products and avoid getting them in your cat's eyes or mouth. Use a clean, dry towel or a hair dryer on the lowest heat setting to help dry your cat's fur. If you choose to use a hair dryer, Make sure to keep it at a safe distance and avoid overheating or causing any distress to your cat. After your cat's fur is completely dry, give it a final brush using a wide tooth comb or a brush suitable for their fur type. This will help remove any remaining residue and tangles. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your fellow cat owners. For more detailed information and additional tips, make sure to check out the link in the description below. There, you'll find an in-depth article on this topic that includes valuable insights from experts and references to relevant studies and research. Thanks for watching, and until next time, take good care of your furry friends.